and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm very excited about this video because I have found a new hobby, if you will. Just something that I really like to do and that is thrift shopping. Today we're going to do a thrift haul and I was just going to show you the clothes but then I remembered that I love try on hauls so I'm going to try on each item as I'm showing you and we're just going to do a little try on haul. So I went to three different places and these are all just tops. I feel like I have a hard time finding bottoms and I actually did buy a dress but I didn't like how it looked. So anyways, these are all tops. I went to Goodwill, um, DI, Desert Industries, and a Savers. And this is all locally to where I live except the other, the Savers was when I went on a trip. Well, a little weekend trip. But we will start with Goodwill. So, one of the first things I found, I should have buttoned it. It's just a loose button up, kind of flowy, cream, kind of ivory shirt. This is actually from H&M and it's super soft and flowy and I, I really, really like it. A nice staple to have, honestly. And you can really pair it with anything. Denim will look really cute, like high-waisted denim. And I really, really like this. I think I bought it, got it for like $3.99. Next is one of my favorites. Okay, so here's my tip. Go to the men's section of the thrift store and you will find gyms because that's where I have found all of my favorite things. So this, it's kind of like a Henley sweater. So it's got two buttons up, two? Yep, two buttons up top. And then it's just like a cute, slouchy, oversized sweater. I think it's an extra large. Hey, this is Eddie Bauer. I found all my favorite sweaters were Eddie Bauer in the, at the thrift store. Um, so this is an XL in men's. And I love the oversized fit. I can cuff the um, arms if I need to, if they are a little bit long. But I love it and I love this green color lately. Speaking of green, I also found this at Goodwill and it's one of the amazingly soft, I think, flannels from American Eagle. And I just don't like own any flannels. All of my ones were from like middle school that I obviously got rid of. Um, so I didn't have any flannels and this was like $3.99 for an American Eagle um, flannel. And they're super soft, super com- super? super comfortable and you can throw them over anything and good layering with those so i'm glad that i found that so this is a j crew brand um it's a cropped sweater except if you look at it it looks like a children's sweater because guess what i put it in the dryer so i'll try it on for you but it's gonna be kind of short but i'm gonna keep it anyway because i like it and it's cute and it kind of fits but it's a little bit itchy, I think, yep, it's 100% wool. Um, but I really like it, cute pattern and cute colors. Okay, last thing from Goodwill. Oh, the tag. Um, it's this tank, like muscle. It's this uh, muscle tank kind of thing. I don't know how to explain it. I was looking for a sweater vest but I couldn't find any at literally all these surf stores that I went to. But I found this and I like it paired over like a turtleneck um, long sleeve. Just a good layering piece. I, I don't have a lot of red so that was out of the, my comfort zone. Next is Savers. And I don't know why I'm so attracted to these like men's clothing items that just look so like cozy yet like cute so this is actually a fruit of the loom shirt <laughs> what is i don't know if it's like an undershirt or like a i don't know what is this fabric but anyways it's a fruit of the loom long sleeve light gray and i just really really thought it was cute and thought i could make it look cute with what I wear, I don't know, but it's way cute. It's a good staple. I could wear it with like anything or layer it under something, but I really, really like that. Um, I also have this, oh my gosh. Is this not so cute? Like, this is also men's. It's also Eddie Bauer. It's a medium, um, 
It looks kind of small, so I think it'll fit me perfectly. Um, and I just love, like, in the men's section, they just have this, like, chunky knit. Like, I feel like all the women's stuff is, like, thin, and I don't like it. I love this. I actually haven't worn it yet or tried it on, but I, I just know I'm gonna love it. The color is also beautiful. Beige buttons, just, it's a good sweater all around. Okay, the next item is like my absolute favorite. It's green. Um, my favorite color right now is green. I don't know why, but it's just really vibing for me. How cute is this? Like, okay, I'm gonna try it on, so I don't need to do it right now, but it's this like, it literally looks like it's homemade. Um, it's like a green, lighter green mixed in with like a blue or green and it's just so pretty. And the knit is so nice and chunky and it's oversized and I tucked in my jeans and it just looks really awesome. It's also a little itchy though. Um, it says made in Scotland by McDonald's. 100% pure wool that would explain why it's kind of itchy, but I like it too much to not wear it Okay, now we're going on to the stuff I got from DI um, At first you might look at the shirt and say mm, I don't think so. It's another one of those <laughs> This is literally all the men's shirts I buy. It's like the Henley with the few buttons and What is this waffle? Waffling material, okay and this is black. It's also oversized because that's how I like it. Um, all of this is ripping off, so I don't know if I know what size it is, but um, really cute. I tucked it into some high-waisted jeans. I wore it last weekend and I had this necklace on with it and jewelry, that jewelry is necklace, and earrings, and I thought it looked way, way cute. So again, another like good staple, wear it a lot with anything Love it. Okay, this next one is a little bit different than all my other stuff. Um, it's this like oh, lilac, purpley color. It's really pretty and it has um, a little, why don't I know any, any words? It's like ruffled around the neck and the sleeves. Ruffled ain't the right word, but you know what I mean. And then it has this like striping. Um, and it's really cute. I wore it for uh, one of the pictures I just posted on Instagram. But it's a little different. A little different color than I usually get. And super feminine and cute. Okay, have not worn this yet. Um, but it's a mock neck. And it's a short sleeve red knit. Um, I really like mock necks and knits and sweaters, obviously. I'm not sure why I went for red because... Like I said, I don't wear a lot of red and I had that other red item, but I just thought this was really cute. The cut was cute and it's nice to have some red things. You know, I can wear this on Valentine's, Christmas, really any holiday in the winter time. So I like it. Okay, last thing is, I also haven't worn this, a white turtleneck, long sleeve white turtleneck, like literally like what your first grade teacher wore underneath all her t-shirts. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> not that that's a bad thing. If that's like the style nowadays too. But I just wanted this to have like a staple white shirt and have one to wear in the winter. And I can also wear this under, uh, I don't know if I could wear it under like a t-shirt like this. It might be a little too baggy, but it's a little oversized. Just really cute, you can wear a necklace right here. But actually I haven't tried it on, so we'll see how it looks in the try on. That is going to be all for my thrifting try on haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope it inspires you to like go thrift shopping because literally you take like 20 bucks and you're like, this is all I can spend. And normally if you go to a regular store, you'd be like, can't even get one thing. But go to the thrift store, you can get like four, five, six different things that you love. And I think it's freaking cool. So go try it out if you haven't. And you will probably find some really good gems. And you'll probably want to do it again like me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye.